Welcome back family. Today we are making custom dominoes. My last video I showed you how to make the mold from scratch so I'll link that down in the description bar but let's go ahead and get into the video. We're going to start with our resin, our mixing cups, and our mixing stick. I'm also using glitter. I'm using Recollections brand by Michaels. It's a black and silver blend. You're going to mix your resin thoroughly, and after, you're going to pour in your glitter. I'm going to fill my molds halfway with the glitter mix. The way I'm doing this is completely optional. I'm doing it in two parts because I want to make sure that when I place my image on the back that it's sealed in with epoxy. Some people might want to do it in one step, but I want to make sure that everything is centered correctly because I don't want you to see the dots from the back. You'll see what I mean as we proceed. I found my images on Google. I basically put them in Cricut Design Space, resized them, printed them out, and now my Cricut is going to cut them. I'll have the dimensions in the description box. This is what my dominoes look like about 12 hours later once they have dried. Because the mixture is so thin, they dry pretty quickly. What I'm about to do now is take my image and place it on the back of the dominoes. You do not have to remove the dominoes from the back of the mold. Like I stated, I'm a perfectionist, so I wanted to make sure everything was centered correctly. Here's what the dominoes look like with the stickers attached. Now we're going to fill the remainder of the mold with more epoxy. Like I stated, this could be done in one part, 
but because I wanted to make sure that nothing shifted, I made I did it in two. Here are the dominoes 12 hours later once they have cured. Not all, but some of the dominoes had a few rough edges, so I took a sanding block that I got from Dollar Tree and some dish detergent and sanded down the edges. Because I'm doing Carolina Panther dominoes, I wanted the blue to match as close as it could to the Carolina Panthers, so I'm using a cool blue acrylic paint to paint my dots. Well, we have reached the end of this video. If you like what you see, give it a thumbs up. Any questions, leave it down in the comments. Everything that I use will be in the description bar. If you have not yet subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification button so you can be notified every time I post a video. Also, don't forget to follow all of my Instagrams, Purposeful Printing, Eden's Rain Body Therapy, and my personal, Derricka White. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.